Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And very good morning to all my beloved students, Year 5 Arif DLP and also all students across Malaysia. So today, again, we stay in our lesson for Mathematics DLP Year 5 uh, which is still in Unit 6 space. So today we're going to see the next subtopic uh, which is uh, measuring interior angles means uh, mengukur sudut dalaman alright from previous lesson uh, we have learned about a few example of regular uh, regular polygons so if so <coughs> for your information each uh, regular polygons got a specific value of interior angles eh? For each polygons, alright. As you can see in your textbook, you can refer to page uh, 219 and 220. Okay, there is a few example there. So, uh, if we want to measure the interior angles, we need a tool which is called protector. Eh? Jadi untuk kita mengukur sudut dalaman. Kita memerlukan uh, satu alat yang kita panggil sebagai uh, jangka sudut eh? Ataupun dalam bahasa Inggeris, we call it as protector Okay, as you can see in page 219 and 220 Alright, now let me try a few example here Alright, the first one is uh, equilateral uh, triangle Okay this is a protector. Alright. Now let we... Okay, so this one we write as A. Angle of A. This is B. And this one is C. Alright. Okay, let we measure the interior angles for A. Okay, so we put the protector here. So make sure the center of uh, protector is exactly at the angles. Alright. Okay, so now we see. So from zero. So as you can see here. Alright, for angle A, start from zero until 60 all right which means angle of a equal to 60 degree all right how about angle of b okay so i drag here the protector so again make sure the center of protector all right within the angles of uh angle that we want to measure so in this situation we want to measure the angles of B right, as you can see here so from 0 until 60 so angle of B also equal to 60 degree alright how about angle of C ok so we move this protector okay so we turn round this protector all right so again so for angle of c so start from 0 0 until 60 so angle of c also equal to 60 degree uh, all right so this is the the interior angles for equilateral triangle all right all right as we learn from the previous lesson for regular polygons we have all the angles are in equal value Alright, now we go to the next polygon. Alright, this is a hexagon. Got six sides, 
eh, six straight sides of polygon. Okay. Again, we take out our protector. Okay, we want to measure. All right. We take this one. Okay, we take this one. Okay, this is A. Alright, let we measure A and B. Alright, okay. So, we drag our protector here. So, make sure we start from zero. So, we turn our protector. Okay, so you see here from 0 until 120. Okay, as you can see at the protector. So, the angle of A equal to 120 degree. Okay, how about B? Okay, we drag our protector to the angle of B. So, again, make sure start from 0. Okay, the center of protector. So, 0, okay, we, so you see here 0 until 120 also. So, angle of B also equal to 120 degree. So, which means if here we got which mean if here, if here we got, this is C, this is angle of uh, D, this is angle of E, and this is angle of F. So, we have all the angles are equal. C equal to 120 degree. Angle of D also equal to 120 degree. Angle of E also equal to 120 degree. And angle of F also equal to 120 degree. So, I hope all everyone you can understand on how we measure the interior angle for polygons. So, inshallah, see you again in next lesson. So, see you again everyone. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye.